Now we discuss why phase velocity has no physical significance. We know that phase velocity equal to ratio of angular frequency and wave number and omega equal to twice pi nu and we can write twice pi nu means e upon h as e equal to h nu and as per energy mass relation, energy relation e equal to mc square and we can write it twice pi mc square upon h and if mass is relativistic then we can write m equal to m naught upon under root 1 minus v square upon c square put the value of mass in this relation and it becomes 2 pi m naught c square upon h under root 1 minus v square upon c square and similarly k means wave number that is equal to 2 pi upon lambda where lambda is de Broglie wavelength and this de Broglie wavelength is equal to h upon p put the value of de Broglie wavelength 2 pi upon lambda means h upon p and p is mass into velocity upon h and put the value of mass in the relativity form 2 pi m naught v upon h under root 1 minus v square upon c square and phase velocity is omega upon k omega is 2 pi m naught c square upon h under root 1 minus v square upon c square upon k k means 2 pi m naught v upon h under root 1 minus v square upon c square this term cancel out 2 pi m naught cancel out and vp equal to c square upon v where v is velocity of particle if particle is moving by velocity of light then vp becomes c it means if particle moves by velocity of light then phase velocity is also equal to velocity of light but particle cannot be moved by phase velocity of light it means v is always less than c and vp is greater than c it means phase velocity is greater than velocity of light which is not possible it means phase velocity has no physical significance thank you